Positively Jacks tonight, hundreds of Navy families reunited at NAS Jacks today. Two squadrons have returned from overseas where they took part in several missions to protect our country. News for Jacks reporter Crystal Moyer was there for the emotional reunions. For families like the Gerald's, it was a homecoming six months in the making. What are worries at? What's going on? What don't we know? Um, but I know in reality he's protected us. Dozens of families gathered here at NAS Jacks waiting for their loved ones to arrive. Even the rain couldn't keep these families down after two squadrons and hundreds of Navy sailors returned home today flying in on those Poseidon P-8s. Dozens of sailors stepped off the plane and into the arms of their loved ones with hugs, kisses and tears. Brian Conlin sees his two sons and wife for the first time in half a year. I'm extremely grateful that live in this country. I'm extremely grateful to have a wonderful family. Wonderful. Just incredibly blessed and very glad the last six and a half months are, are over and he's home. As you can imagine, staying in touch with family during an overseas deployment is difficult. A 13 hour time difference makes it a lot tougher. So my night is their morning and uh, uh, it's difficult, but my wife's very strong. So she uh, she took care of him. She ran the house while I was gone and uh, you know, now I'm just trying not to get in the way. Oh, I'm so excited. It feels like I've been gone forever. It's good to be back. Patrol Squadron VP-45 returned from Japan for military operations, as well as assisting with counter-narcotics operations along the Pacific Ocean. There's nearly 300 sailors in the squadron. Crystal Moyer, Channel 4, The Local Station.